Hi everyone. Good afternoon to everyone. So today we are going to demonstrate how a rotating magnetic field is produced in a three phase induction motor. So this is nothing but a three phase induction motor and we are going to give the AC supply to the primary winding of the transformer and from secondary winding of the auto transformer we have been connected to R phase, Y phase and blue phase and this is nothing but this induction motor we are having three windings phase shifted with 120 degrees electrical as well as mechanical and we have been kept in rotor so this is nothing but the you can see here as soon as uh, we are give already had been given the supply if you just help the rotor to rotate uh, it is able to rotate of its own okay so the rotor just if you rotate it uh, this the rotating magnetic field which is produced uh, is making the rotor to rotate it is see here it is able to easily propel so let's try to increase some little bit uh, voltage so slowly if you increase the voltage level the rotor starts rotating so you can see here the, rot the rotor is rotating of its own okay so you see here the magnetic field which is uh, produced is making the rotor to rotate uh, slowly little bit i'm increasing the voltage uh, you can see that effect okay so so it is uh, unbalanced that's why it is coming back so once again we are going to give the voltage okay so once again we are increasing the voltage level slowly and you can see here the rotor will start rotating okay so you can see the rotor is started rotating of its own you can see here the rotor starts rotating of its own and that's how we can understand that a rotating magnetic field is produced in an three phase induction motor so now let us try to remove this type of rotor appeal